Now, nah, that's the good stuff. And so the idiots continued their long, pointless quest, traipsing through the wasteland they made, crushing priceless <laughs> coral reefs under their boots. The exposed seabed reveals its hidden treasure. There was a lot of junk. <laughs> in a lot of flotsam. Flotsam? Are you sure it's not jetsam? Flotsam is stuff that fell off. Jetsam is stuff that got thrown off. Huh. I don't even have a snappy comeback. That's just interesting. Sometimes learning can be fun. Do you see the destruction she leaves in her wake? A wasteland of broken toys, wondering why their creator has forsaken them. But I guess it's all just set dressing to you, Fate Maker. You keep a gate bars your way, and a gentleman stands just before it. A gentleman wearing a pirate hat. Oh, but he's not just any pirate. He's a skeleton pirate! Skeleton, kill him! No, 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 hey, hey, he is not a bad -o. He's a good boy, he's a special boy! I'll be the judge of that. Avast! I need to get through this gate. Aye, ye be wanting to just waltz right through the gates of the briny shelf, are ye? Will ye be speaking to Bones Threewood, cursed protector of the southern gate, and I say... <laughs> sure. Huh, that was easy. Of course it'll do ye no good. The Nerpen Gate is guarded by a vengeful, murderous, gorgeous buccaneer known as Chartreuse Lachance. He'll never let ye through. Unless... Would ye be willing to help me on a quest? Ho ho ho! Pirate quest! It's a pirate quest! Valentine, do you want to go on the pirate quest? Oh, I really, really do! Ha-ha! <laughs> Welcome to the crew! But there'll be no pirate quest without Polly, me faithful bird Munculus. A terrible fate befell her, and we be needing to put her pieces back together. Forgotten before they hit the ground. Cinder. <laughs> oh, you are fat. Oh, that be Polly's eye patch. Paradoxically, it helps her see where to go.
Navigational flappers keeps Polly high in the air <sighs> to spot sails on what used to be the horizon. Now crack some kites. We need that squawker. Can't run from the storm. She'll be squawking in no time. She be nearly complete. All that's left is her polymagical core. She be powered by soul energy, naturally. Who was that? As I feared, tis Mobley Dick, aforementioned biter of crews, scourge of salt and sand. Be careful. Squawker on her. <laughs> there she is. Oh, wait, is this so component? <laughs> Polly, it's really you. I miss Jimmy, trusty bird homunculus. Are you ready to join me, crew, again? <laughs> Polly's back from the dead. Why do we need a bird? Polly's me navigator. If we're to take on La Chance and open the Nerpin gate, we needs the help of me former crew. Now sniff them out, Polly! Sniff them out! Sniff them out! Chartreuse La Chance ain't just a mighty pirate. He's unkillable. There's a rare curse upon his crew. Tis known as plot armor. I know it well, for it be the same curse I bear. We'll be needing more than guns and ships to defeat him. This away! This away! Ha! 
A grog like frowns of earth. And fruit snack! It tastes like food. Oi, that be me first mate and his fellows. They'll never listen to you if you don't start a fight with them first. Challenge him to a duel. But we try to Hear that, lads? The hero wants to fight. <laughs> Twouldn't be a fair fight for ye. See, we've got plot armor. Plus, me grog mug's still full of strictly non-alcoholic brew. I'm scray. Okay, so how do we get this guy to fight? Easy. Pirate Rule 27B. Spell grog must be avenged. Break his mug. But we try to evade You've run afoul of Pirate Rule 27B! Now that's a serious breach of decorum! You trying to pick a point with us, Hailer? I said I was. Why should I? I bet you fight like a dairy farmer. <gasps> Wait, why are we gasping? Because you've just been challenged to a duel of disses. It's the pirate way. Now we gotta hit him with the cutness, meanness, wake up in a cold sweat 20 years later as comeback, or we lose the duel. We're gonna need options. Your mom should have thrown you away and kept the stalk. No one talks about Debra first mate like that! Jorgen Kielhall! me, didn't you?
he's brought us new recruits. Come sail the open air with a mighty pirate Lachance in the new airship Windbreaker. All men wanted! Ah, uh, I've cast my lot with Bones Threewood's crew. Bones Threewood? It's thanks to him me and Cobby here look like this. We won't be joining ye. The chances are come to now, so you'd best be on your way. Cabby, back to the song. Oh, what will we do They've with a in with the chance? Mute and sea dogs. Crew, go to the new fight. Pirate rule 81D. If a balloon be popped, the popper must be dropped. Oh, look at you. Uh, who cares about some stupid toy balloons? Tis a dire day oh, with the pirate rules be the ignored. Sailor, we need to be getting their attention for real. Up the Windbreaker's balloon! <laughs> Down to the dry depths with ye! God, they blew up Lachance's ship! My best breaches were on there! New recruits, show these mean elbow timber shiverers what your pegs are made of! Chiseler. Before someone gets really hurt, we'll join back up with Three Woods crew. <laughs> I have me crew back now for our ship. She be the finest wooden woman to ever ride the buttery sea. Polly, find us the wreck of the Marley Maiden. Find the maiden. Find the maiden. <laughs> Enough, you pox picking chest chiseler. Before someone gets really hurt, we'll join back up with Three Woods crew. <laughs> I have me crew back now for our ship. She be the finest wooden woman to ever ride the buttery sea. Polly, find us the wreck of the Marley Maiden. Find the maiden. Find the maiden. <laughs> We've gotten to know each other pretty well in the last few minutes. So here be the tale of woe that brought me down to the depths of what used to be the old. <gasps> Hell yes. Pirate backstory. Great, I'm just gonna tune out for a minute. I was the fiercest pirate captain on the buttery seas. I had a fine ship, a loyal crew, and... <gasps> but I lost. <laughs> Wait, that's it? Didn't even explain the curse. Mm. Oh, so me pirate backstory be insufficient for ye. Never mind then, ye scurvy cur. Ha! See? She's got nothing. She always forgets to drop character voice when she's scrambling for a decent motivation. Dead by dead cop! Looks like 
cosmetics back on the menu. Knock you all down! The dip! Singing songs about me soon. Body ones, I hope. Our way is blocked. Pull it! Time to unleash your breaking beacon beak! Center on the bow. 
She be looking as fine as a lady can look. Over here, we'll raise the Marley Maiden back to fighting she. A ship's got a soul as much as any man, and I've been practicing my performance. Time to get these wooden bones dancing again. Crew, a tune if you will. Chartreuse called you Lord's three wood. Got anything to tell us? He deserved the whole truth. And there's only one way to properly deliver pirate backstory. <laughs> the tunnel full of music and elaborately staged vignettes. Places, everyone! <laughs> elaborately staged vignettes. Places, everyone! <laughs> The man is known to me. The curse took hold. My bow said no. Blow me, bony boys, blow. He true militant man, his song will wool her the sands. One day when our penance is done, we'll take our chance and go. Together we stormed o'er many a shore, and out to the other we both swore. Why, Charlie was my true one more. Blow me, bony boys, blow. He drew the skeleton man, his song of woe heard cross the sands. One day when our penance is done, we'll take our chance and go. <laughs> Him dealt with the devil and paid in sin. We gained our years but lost our skin. Blow me, bony boys, blow. Oh, yeah, I got him with the old live forever grift. Works all the time. No shortage of wayward souls clinging to the scraps of fading memories. Jeez, listen to me. I sound like her. Charlie. and consign me to oblivion. There's the truth. I got him with the old live forever grift. Works all the time. 
No shortage of wayward souls clinging to the scraps of fading memories. Jeez, listen to me. I sound like her. Charlie couldn't forget. He and his men sunk the Barley Maiden, scattered me crew, and consigned me to oblivion. There's the truth. the land, trying to mend what was broken. Every step reveals another lost hope. The task seems insurmountable, but a hero must keep moving forward. This be it, crew! Beyond that wall lies the Tempest Scorn. Let's batten down some hatches and shiver some timbers! Fire! Chance. I be sorry. I should have asked you before I cursed us all to undead. I was so afraid of losing ye that I wasn't thinking straight. You've never thought straight a moment in your life or a life. But thank you. I can't lift this curse of ours, but I can spend the rest of our deaths making it up to ye. All I need is a la chance. Damn your pirate wiles, Three Wood. Me heart be always yours. I accept. 
Sorry, crew. No room for the living on this vessel. But I reckon this won't be the last we see of each other. After all, you're the fate maker, and fate <laughs> brings us together. You'll find the key to the Nerpen Gate in my hidden booty room. You're welcome to plunder it. I found all the treasure I need. Take care of Polly, crew. Come on!